All right, folks, Tim here from High End Cheat Tech. And uh, today we're going to go over this little product here. It's pretty much the last thing I haven't done a long-term review on. And it's worth every damn penny. It's the Zedio um, tripod. Very small, very compact. We'll get to that right after the introduction. All right, folks, I'm back. And uh, what are we looking at here? This is a Zedio uh, all metal construction tripod. I picked it up for $8.99 on uh, Amazon. That link will be in the description below. Please use my links. I get a small kickback. $8.99, folks, isn't bad for this considering this will work just fine with the uh, um, Ampow selfie stick that I'm using it with right now. I haven't had to fold these legs down in months because I just screwed the Zetio into it and we're done. And this thing has an exceedingly small footprint which makes it just so amazingly cool. And it's kind of screw it into your, they, they do give you a little hex tool, but you really don't need it. It'll snug up pretty good all by its lonesome and not come unscrewed. And it will also work with, of course, the, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, DJI Osmo, which means you don't need to buy their overpriced tripod from them. So that's all up to you. If you're looking into the DJI, I still don't have a phone I can use it with. So I thought I'd, you know, just tell you a little bit about it. Like I said, this thing is solid. It's all metal construction. It does have a little hex wrench it comes with that you can stick in there and then tighten it up really tight if you're gonna just like leave it on something. Forever. But in most cases, snugging it in there will get the job done. You, it's not going to come unscrewed at all. Never has for me. So it's an excellent product. It's eight dollars and ninety-nine cents. All metal. They have a upgraded one. You don't really need it. And uh, of course, it alleviates me having to pull a telescoping arm up here and having my tripod on my Impo selfie stick sitting here kind of balanced at an angle and it, you just shouldn't have to do that and so you fold the boat I haven't had these legs folded down on the Impo selfie stick in ages still also a worthwhile investment um, but you just screw this thing into it you can snap it open. It'll fit in a pretty tiny footprint as compared to the uh, legs on the um, M-Pow, which stick out a long ways, and they're kind of spindly. And they're not, they're not as conducive to a small area studio like I have as uh, something else. This is worth every penny, as usual. Once again, I'm gonna say it one more time. Check my links in the description below. You can also find the Impulse Selfie Stick, which we're still using to turn the video on and to turn the video off. I love the little remote. It is the coolest thing. Some sliced bread. I can sit back five feet away and not have to worry. So that's all I have this afternoon. I would like to thank everyone who stuck with me, all our new subscribers. I don't know where they're coming from, and I don't care. We love subscribers. I just wish I had some stuff to send you. 
as far as my stimulus update it was supposed to get mailed today so I'm figuring Tuesday I should have it by Tuesday night I'll transfer the funds I will buy the P30 um, light from Huawei and thanks federal government and TurboTax for delaying my return for two weeks because now the price has gone up from like it was 212 now it's like 234 still not bad and I will also purchase the, uh, the Samsung um, A51 and we'll get them both here ASAP I might go ahead and spend a little bit of extra dollars over at uh, um, d and Photo I'll go like two dollars over the three hundred dollar limit but I'd actually be paying two eighty four for it and I can get a rinky fusion case for that and for the P30 um, so all that being said that's all I have today all we can do is wait and pray to God the feds are going to fulfill their promise of dropping like I think it was like 30 million people who H&R uh, Block Jackson Hewitt and TurboTax also known as Intuit screwed over and they didn't have the balls in their websites to say oh yeah that return that you're looking at is not what we sent to the feds so when you're getting returns you might be getting 100 back a day 200 back and they can wade through those take the money out and transfer it to your Intuit card when you get 3 million back in one they got nowhere to go so they had to send all that money back and now the feds are sending out checks apparently we went right to the top of the list so thank god uh, at first the feds were trying to send it again to the and it's like no don't do that so now they're mailing out stimulus checks and depending on the postal service it's a lot of checks but they're coming from there's a lot of different offices the IRS has to print up checks and they'll come from various offices around the country depending on where you're located and they'll go to your last known address if you moved um, it it will get forwarded and you'll get it very shortly if that happened to you I for one will never as long as I live do business with TurboTax again because all they had to do on day one was post up on the front of their site what's going on with your return and admit the return you downloaded and saw in that routing number is not the return the Fed saw and the bank and the routing number. That simple. And if they admitted that, I wouldn't have sat there every day going, please, dear God, please be here be here no explanation absolutely and on all three of these company sites none they failed and they're they're still not admitting they're not going to admit that the return you see ain't what the IRS gets I even called TurboTax itself uh, and uh, yeah, that's a different number than their card people who were just not taking calls at all, basically. And uh, you know, they're just like check our frequently asked questions, and n nothing in there covering this, by the way. So I called TurboTax and I went, "I'm going to ask you one question, and don't lie to me." And I said, is the return that I'm looking at on my screen right now with my bank, my routing number, and you know my account number that shows up on my TurboTax card if I go to the Intuit site, is that the return the IRS got? 
absolutely, sir. And I was like, thank you. You just lied to me. I will never do business again. I will badmouth you as long as I live. Never, ever lie to a customer. So I hope you all have a good day. Hopefully you'll get your stimulus checks soon. Hopefully I'll get mine soon. And we'll be buying some phones. Buying some phones. Like right away in second. <coughs> oh, excuse me, after I receive it. I know about seconds because I gotta go over and put the money on, on some kind of card. It sends it. <laughs> it certainly won't be the Intuit card. I have a net spend card, I'll throw it all on there. Or at least enough to get by with order and what I need for the first day, which will be the two phones and two rinky fusion cases for them. And we'll be done at that point. So thanks for watching this. Thanks for sticking around and thanks for subscribing if you found this helpful, useful, informative, or not. Please subscribe anyway. And uh, give us a thumbs up in the video and leave some feedback that's even better watch the whole thing folks it's not that long thanks for watching we'll catch you in the next one